Hey, welcome to another Geek Eclectic Podcast. I'm Stu. I'm Nick. This is Buddha Beer. And we're going to get drunk. And this is uh, this is Founders Curmudgeon. Yeah, Stu got really shit-faced last night. I got night. ripped. <laughs> I got ripped off this. Yeah, we well, I was, it became a designated driver night for me on that one. Yeah. Two we went of them. To, we went to <laughs> two of them. <laughs> and then I was driving. Yeah. So. That was a night... Uh, to remember for sure, it, or forget possibly, but or still. forget. It was definitely, <laughs> it was fucking fun though. Barrio and yeah. booze and sixteen six, bit, sixteen bit, plugging our local, local, local uh, constabulary businesses out here. Yeah, but good shit. Always yeah. good shit. Oh man, so th- there's been so much. Speaking of shit, there's so much shit going down this week. Yes, there is. With Comic Con, San Diego Comic Con going down. SDCC. Yes, and that's not, you know, AIDS or anything like that, or any kind of no. horrible disease. Not yet. That is San Diego Comic Con, abbreviated. Uh, there's all kinds of shit going down, man. Like we we like, we were like going over like what we were going to talk about tonight, and it's just like too much. Just too much. Just too, <laughs> it's too much. much. It's too damn much. So we're just going to lightly graze some of the topics. Yeah. yeah. Starting with, I think, Doctor Who. Doctor Who. Doctor Who. Doctor Who. What did you think of the trailer? Who knows? Um, <laughs> I, I like the trailer. I, I, yeah. Overall, I think it's going to be a good season. Peter Capaldi's yeah. quite an excellent it, doctor. It looks... I mean, here's the thing about like every Doctor Who trailer that we get for each season. Yes. They're always epic, but this one looks... This one looks really epic. Mm-hmm. Like you got like a battlefield. You have all kinds of stuff going on. Uh, we've got Doctor. The, the, the Doctor's got some longer hair. It looks like a little bit, a little bit. Yeah, he's also got a um, guitar though, so it's good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what else? He's. Oh yeah, I saw him wearing the uh, the glasses. I hope those become like a staple of his. That'd be cool. Like the the uh, the Ray Bands he's wearing. And he's playing. Yeah, he's playing a guitar. That is awesome in itself. The female master is going to return. Hell yes, you knew she Missy. was going to. Oh, you know, you knew she you knew was. She was going to. You knew she was. The Zygons. Oh, the Zygons, am I? The Zygons, yeah. Uh, let me think here. What else? Uh, of course, I think there are some Daleks. The Daleks, of course Daleks are in there. Come on, son. Um, let's see. Oh, and. I love the last line, I'm the doctor and I save people. I save people. I love it. I'm Scottish. It's fucking great. Save people. I just, I love the fact that the Zygons are in it, because I remember you and I were talking from watching the 50th anniversary. I loved them. We were both like, oh, These God. need to be back. Yes. We need some more of pretty much all of this. I'm glad they're bringing them back. So we're, we're going to have a mix of older characters. We're obviously going to have some new... We're gonna have some monsters. We're gonna mm. have, um, which I'm pretty excited about. I, I saw an image of. Uh, it looked like a. I don't know what it was. It looked really cool. It was like an armored monster. I forgot what it was called. Uh, Bob. Bob the. Armored Bob. Monster. That's it. <laughs> Bob the monster. Bob the armored monster. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past the doctor though to be like that's Bob. Bob the monster. Uh. We do have some surprises though, because uh, whereas the master's returning, that uh, do you remember the one guy in the one? Uh, his name was Rigsy. He was like a graffiti artist. Yeah. He was in that. Um, he was in the graffiti episode. Yeah. Where everything became. And he 2D. helped. He was almost like a companion to, and while Claire was almost like the doctor, mm. and the doc, the real doctor was stuck in stuck the, inside the, the tiny TARDIS. Yeah. In the teeny tiny TARDIS. The teeny tiny. But he's coming back this season, so I'm, I'm interested to see what they're going to do with him. Uh, and also, good news. Good news, everyone. Good news. Good, good news, news, everyone. Good news, everyone. <laughs> uh, do you guys remember Oz? Do you remember Osgood from the 50th yeah, anniversary? Yeah, the scarf wearing girl. Yeah. The girl who's got all the collectibles, <laughs> Doctor Who wear. Yeah. Well, su- suppose that she died. Spoiler she did. alert. In at the hands yes. of Missy. Spoiler the from eight. the uh, <laughs> uh, end of the series, yes. last one. Yeah. There are probably some people that 
could still be behind. Welcome. So sorry about that. Uh, she's not dead, apparently. So or at least not you. entirely. Well, you're traveling in time. Well, no, no, no. Uh, she might be one of the uh, um, Zygons. Mm. Interesting. Honestly, they could do whatever the fuck they want now. Because we, we found out we found out that the, that the um, regenerations have changed. Mm -hmm. He's no longer limited to just you know. He's limited to all of them. Yeah. So now he's not just not limited to what thirteen or whatever. So. Nope. Well, he already passed it anyway. Well, yeah. Yeah, um, and, and Macy Williams. Macy is Williams gonna is going to be in it. Yeah. I have no idea as what, but I'm interested. The she the end of it, the you. What took you so long, old man? <laughs> Well, she's supposed to test the doctor, so I don't know if she's going to be a companion in some sort of capacity. I like it either she, way. Yeah, I think it's fucking great. So Macy Williams of Game of Thrones fame. Game of Thrones fame. Game, Game of, of Thrones, Thrones fame. fame. There's a lot going on in that trailer. It just it looks epic as hell. Uh, so I'm I'm pretty excited for that. I know you are too. We're God, huge, yes. We're, 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 we're huge Hoovians. Yes. And. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Good evening. Huge Hoovians here. Good evening. Hoovians Central. Uh, <laughs> registered. Trademarked. If it's not, we're taking it. It's, 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 it's probably taken. I'm not, I know. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, that was pretty uh, epic uh, as far as trailers go. Uh, but what... Um, <laughs> did you just draw a Zygon? I did. Here, let me zoom in on this. So, can you hold it up to the camera? And I will. Uh... It looks more like a Klansman. <laughs> I was going. Uh, but I'm not going to say it here. Can you just make it? I was thinking that it was possibly a cone head. The center there. Oh, that's as far as I can go. Bring it up a little more. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Anybody? Can, can you guys see the the clans? <laughs> the Klansman side. <laughs> possibly cone head. Oh shit. Wow. Possibly Conehead. Yeah, possibly. A little bit. Yeah. And we hope you enjoyed that word from our sponsors. Yeah. <laughs> Whoever you are, we love Thanks you. to you. Yeah. Buddha Beer. Lucky Buddha Beer. Founders Curmudgeon. Old ale brewed with molasses and oak aged. Oh, yes. And, of course, it'll get you drunk. It will. Yes, it will. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> let's see. Uh, so what? It, what else did you have on the list, man? Since we just uh, talked about the doctor, and you showed us our your lovely. Well, I think Zygon. I think <laughs> my Zygon is actually. You're, you're keeping that, by the way. Oh, we're gonna we put are. that back here. Uh, we are. We're gonna we might start make a it wall. Look less like a. We're gonna start a wall of art. We might make it look like less of a conehead clansman. <laughs> but yes. <laughs> I love it. Oh uh, my god. Let's see. Uh, since we just hit Game of Thrones, I'm going to do a little quick sp Please uh, do. spot. This is uh, Nick's. So, uh, Jon Snow's dead. What the fuck, man? Welcome. No. <laughs> Except, obviously, he's not because that don't make no fucking sense. Now, mind you, could he, his character name be dead, killed off? Mm -hmm. Maybe he's no longer going to be Jon Snow. He's no longer a commander of the wall. Mm -hmm. Maybe he's now just kind of a. I want to say civilian, but civilian possibly. Is he like in hiding or something, or did he? Uh, no, he... he got stabbed the fuck. Good. So he's in hiding. Yes, yeah, severely. Death. Well, yeah, literally, <laughs> literally, <laughs> literally. He's the, hiding in a coffin because he's dead. Last, I think, scene even of the season that just happened yeah. was pulling away as you see blood just expanding oh. out this side of him. Oh, so he was just, just spurting. Oh yeah, he was. Oh no, not spurting, but he was just bleeding. Just coming out, out bleeding out. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but that, that don't make no damn sense to me because I always kind of thought that he was the Song of Ice and Fire. Which, Stu, you know less about yes. Game of Thrones than you should. So, cover your ears. Push harder. All right. Uh, I'm in. Uh, as he then answered me. Just saying. Because, uh, obviously, I personally think that... Uh, uh, your ears are uncovered. It's fine. Um, I think Lyanna Stark him. and uh, uh, Rhaegar Targaryen are the parents of Jon Snow. You've got one hand over one ear, you bitch. Uh, we are the world. Sure. Uh, which doesn't make sense. I think that, I personally think he's going to be back, maybe not next season, but the season after, the final season. 
So that's what's going on. And in case you missed it, there were some badass fucking scenes for Jon Snow this season, including killing a White Walker lieutenant. The White Walkers are pretty badass. They're mean they? some bitches. Yeah, I keep hearing... He'll be back. Do you think he'll be back in some sort of I think so. sense? I think he will be, because I As honestly mean, believe he's probably one of the he has to be. three forces that will stop the invasion of the White Walkers if they're able to. There you go. Also, in case you hadn't seen it, uh, Tyrion and Danny were fucking phenomenal together this season. Uh, they weren't together a lot, but when they were, fucking gold. My personal favorite scene was them drinking together. I'm not going to even try and do it. I'm just going to say, go watch it. You don't want to drink drinking. like... You don't want to drink oh, like Oh, I'll Tyrion. drink like Tyrion. I will drink with Tyrion. Yeah. But he will drink watch too. that fucking scene. It is phenomenal. Some of the best stuff that actually has happened. I'm going to have to look this up. You're going to have to actually watch it. I'm going to have to actually watch it all the way through. Yeah. Uh, see, Nick's the more uh, experienced Game of Thrones. And I yes. Don't know. So, well, thank you for that update, Nick. That's Stu, what do you got? What do we have next? What do you got? Oh, my goodness gracious. We have... This is bodacious. <laughs> we have some... What else do we have? We have... Uh, we've got Arrow. We've I, got Fear oh, the Walking it. Dead. We've got... Uh, Ash versus Evil Dead. We got Sherlock. Yeah. That's the big stuff we're focusing on tonight. Trailer madness. On Trailer madness, people. Trailer madness on Geek Galactic. Well, I um, no trailers. No discussion. Discussion of reaction. Trailers. Trailer reaction. Palooza. Geek Galactic. Insert text. We're here. not going to probably do that, but yeah. sure. Blinking sign right away. Trailer madness. Woo! Uh, possibly Terry Crews. So, DC Legends of Tomorrow trailer. That was good. That was awesome. FYI, I actually like. I like the way that they. You know, it was. It was definitely a recap of yes. the Flash and Arrow. I did like how it was done too. But it was like a comic book style. Yes. It was like almost like frame by frame. Yes, sir. Telling, you know, in an interesting. Avenge way. me. And they actually had like different comics, like the older comics and the newer comics mm -hmm. featured uh, some panels. Which was which is pretty awesome. Yes, sir. And then you finally got down to the you know nitty gritty the of it all. You finally nitty got gritty. down the nitty gritty, the DC legends. You get down to uh, to Rory. <laughs> Rory Williams. He's, he's time traveling. <laughs> I'm from um, the future. I'm Rory Williams. We've, I mean, we basically saw a trailer for DC. Uh, DC Legends of Tomorrow like a while ago didn't they release one like yes it was good it was basically the same trailer at the end they just attached it mm -hmm. uh, but altogether it's pretty epic I mean the they're gonna be going against Vandal Savage which is one of the most badass characters and villains in prick. DC Comics oh yeah he is a big prick uh, so it is I understand it's gonna take a huge team to take him down yes and some bad guys uh, yes <laughs> So, I'm curious about that whole dynamic with Captain Cold and, and Heat Wave and, you know, all the other shit going on with... Uh, the Prison Break team. Yeah, the Prison Break team, pretty team much. Team Prison Break. <laughs> we gotta break out of prison. To become Wait, legends. <laughs> why? To become legends, goddammit. <laughs> That's why. So, um... <laughs> I'm curious uh, how that one's going to play out. I think we're going to see some... You're definitely going to see Arrow and Flash uh, appear in each episode. And uh, so, of course, the team is going to be, uh, as I said, Captain Cold, Heat Wave, mm -hmm. uh, White Canary, which I am so happy. Super happy that Laura Lance is... Uh, Sarah Lance. Yes. Yeah, is back. they're sisters. Close enough. No. <laughs> Very happy that the good Lance yes. sister's back. Uh, I believe her name's Katie Lotz or whatever that It is. is. Oh my god. I'm so glad she's back. Um, she was she's excellent. Be, she's going to kick some ass. Yes. And wearing white, apparently. And looking She's good. basically Gandalf the Grey, but white. Yes. White leather. White leather. Gandalf the Grey and white leather. <laughs> instead of being black canary, she's white leather canary. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ma. So, there you go. <laughs> White Canary. White Canary. That's happening. <laughs> so, uh, I'm pretty pumped about that. I don't know about you. I'm super fucking excited. I cannot wait for that. And, and of course, Ray Palmer. The Adam himself. 
Yeah. And uh, am I missing out on anyone else on the team? Yes, oh, Hawk Girl. There Hawk it is. Girl. I'm curious to see. Well, I'm uh, curious about the origin there. story on that one. Yeah, yeah. Because I, I was wondering if they were gonna give. Who you know you knew they were gonna give a show to somebody. Was it gonna be the Adam? Was he gonna get his own show or was yes? You know, is Hawk Girl gonna get? I can see that happening though. If this is successful, I could see that. So I'll see what happens. But I'm, I was actually pretty excited for that one. Super uh, looking forward to it. Yeah. Um, what, what else? What did you have, man? Uh, I you? had uh, Harry and the Hendersons. <laughs> John Lithgow, you <laughs> son of a bitch. <laughs> Nick, okay, so Nick and I recently did a throwback <laughs> gaming video. We did. Of, uh, Bringing you live. Of Call of Duty. Pretty recording. Yes. <laughs> of Call of Duty Black Ops. Was it the original? Black Ops, Black yeah. Ops, yeah. You were doing Kinder Totem. Yeah. And we just got to talking about... How did this even get started? start uh well then we were we talking were about t- harry and the hendersons we at one point we're talking about shit what that. was it it was know. i like, think at one point you're just like you stupid bitch so oh, like yeah. one of the things I, I, was, like, I, was like, I was like whoa there whoa there because we lithgow we watched well, uh john lithgow of course was on dexter and he played the trinity killer i Arthur forgot Miller. forgot what season that was Arthur but Mitchell. We watched that and we were laughing our asses off because he was cracking us up. Dude, I mean, he was great. He was great, phenomenal, solid in that role. And we were both laughing our asses off. Hell's yes. Because we, <laughs> there's a scene where he's just. There's a couple scenes, a lot of scenes in fact. There's from Dexter. a ton of scenes from Dexter. On this uh, one. That's fucking just phenomenal. Yeah. Do yourself a favor. I have to, uh, we gotta find. Was it season? I'm trying to remember. Season three or four. It had to be four, because Miguel Prado was season three, right? And Rita's dead. Yeah. Yeah, Spoiler. season... Season four. <laughs> yes. So, go back, watch Dexter season four. You're gonna laugh your ass off. Because John Lithgow just... I don't know. He just cracked me he up. He makes the fucking show. Yeah. Just that, that part where they're all at the Thanksgiving dinner or whatever... And the wife's like, I appreciate you, honey. And he just looks at her stone faced and like right away he's like, Shut up, come. Yeah. <laughs> For serious. John Lithgow, third Shut rock up. from the sun. Yes. Harry and the Hendersons. The guy from Santa Claus. As DB. <laughs> As DB. From DB Toys. Yes. What do you say? Shut up, come. Boom. <laughs> just, and then he's in the alleyway trying to dog this guy. Just <laughs> You pussy. <laughs> and the guy's like beating the beating the shit out of him. Oh yeah. And he's just like kind of enjoying it or He I was. Don't know. He was he's, getting aroused. He wants to get beat up, I don't know. I believe John Lithgow was yeah. being aroused. I want that to be John Lithgow every day. <laughs> I want famed actor, wonderful, beneficial man to society. You just want him to just, just keep going, going the off worst the same. person in the world. He just comes up to you like, shut up, cunt. Yeah, pretty much. Shut your fucking face. I killed Rita. <laughs> oh god. Nice to meet you, too. Yep. <laughs> Shut up. I don't care. John Lithgow. John Lithgow bringing back uh, all kinds of humor and dignity. Oh, my God. And dignity. So do yourself a favor and go uh, go watch some Dexter Season 4 and Harry and the Hendersons while you're at it. Because we just... Oh, my God. We were just going off. I fucking had to video. pause the video because I was crying. We were going with, with hypotheticals, like wonder if Harry... Harry banged Mrs. Henderson. Harry bangs Mrs. Henderson. <laughs> you know, the woman from A Christmas Story. And in revenge, he... <laughs> I'm gonna find your Bigfoot wife. While she's in, her, while she's in the tub, and I'm gonna do what I gotta do. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh. What the fuck? Okay. All right. Oh, Harry. Okay, Harry's just like, what did I do? What did I do? You fucked my you wife. You fucked my wife. <laughs> God damn it. God. You broke her up to the fucking midsection, you bitch. <laughs> you didn't just proliferate the goddamn cold. You, you split her to the, bl- the fucking belly button, you <laughs> cocksucker. Oh, God. Oh, man. That's right. Harry Anderson's. 
Available on DVD. <laughs> Available on DVD and Blu-ray. It is it? Is. I don't know. It's at least digital down Yeah, go find it. I'm sure you can find it anywhere. Um, anywhere <laughs> the videos are sold. Oh, so, um... <laughs> where do we go from there? Uh, what, do you, what do you have, Nick? Uh, what do I have? <laughs> what do you I just have? gave you Harry and the Andersons. <laughs> but shit, uh, let's see. We got Ash vs. Evil Dead. I can't concentrate. Which now. is all you, buddy. I Ash vs. Evil Dead. I cannot concentrate after that. Okay. Oh, yeah. Ash vs. the Evil Dead. Holy shit. I had the privilege of, of uh, actually meeting uh, Bruce. Mr. Campbell? Yeah, at uh, Wizard World. And he, very nice. Very nice guy. And uh, I love the trailer. The trailer's awesome. It picks up. Ash is still a. He's a hell of a lot older. He's still working as a stock boy. Uh. I forgot what the name of the, the place where he's working at now. It used to be uh, S Mart. That's where he shop, shop smart. smart shop, shop S Smart. I thought that was. I mean, it's awesome that he's, you know, still he's kind of avoiding responsibility, and uh, but he's so he's still stuck in this job he was pretty much doing since he was like in his twenties or whatever. And he mm-hmm. just hasn't progressed. Uh, so, Why would he? What? Why would he? This guy's boomstick. Yeah. Got the boomstick. This guy's fucking so, chainsaw. So for some reason, you know, the 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 dead, the evil dead, come back. The deadites. The deadites. They, they come back to finish what was what what Ash started by opening and reading the Necronomicon. Yes, I think it, I just I loved it. Once I saw him gear up, man, I was pumped. I was so pumped. We're gonna show that in a little bit. Uh, <laughs> just a teaser right there. Uh, the moment where <laughs> he's why gear- I make my money yes. with art. There you go. <laughs> you should have went to art school. The moment where he's gearing up and he fucking steps on the floor and the shotgun comes out of the ground. <laughs> it was fucking awesome. Crack behind him. That's the best part. <laughs> yeah. Shoots behind him Bam. first. Like it's nothing. Not a thing. <laughs> uh, Lucy Lawless is in there. Yes, sir. That- she fucking is. Xena... Yeah. Is now fighting some evil dead. So isn't that That's cool? Right. They, they're they're thaw, back together. Thaw they're together. together forever and never apart. Thanks, Rick. Because they'll always be one. What did you think? Did you like that? I enjoyed it immensely. I'm looking forward to Ash versus the Evil Dead. I really it's actually gonna be am awesome. super excited for it. Yeah. I love I love the ending. Bruce Campbell like, is always good. Uh, I'm wondering if oh. I'm wondering if uh uh Anyone from Burn Notice is going to be on it. Dude. Uh, listen, Mike. Uh, I don't like this. we got to kill some... Uh, we gotta some kill fucking some zombies guys. here, Mikey. we got to kill some zombies, Mike. Okay, Sam. First of all, we've got to make a bomb out of clay. And, and wire. Piece of wire and, and some lucky And an old beer. cell phone. <laughs> And old cell phones always helpful it does, for dealing with bombs. It doesn't take much unless you know the technology. Occasionally it's helpful, but not always. That's why we get the pink <laughs> cell phone. Hi, yeah. my name is Michael Weston. I used to be a spy until he blacklisted. <laughs> we got a burn notice on. We're <laughs> doing the fucking intro from burn notice. <laughs> <laughs> When you're burned, you got nothing. No cash, no, cash, no, no credit. credit. You're left in whatever city they put you in. What's Where am I? Miami. My- <laughs> Miami. Miami. <laughs> Miami. Oh, shit. You know, left to rely on friends. A trigger-happy ex-girlfriend. Should we shoot them? <laughs> An old buddy. I should just put the clip in. It's just <laughs> mouthing what they're saying. An old buddy of mine who used to inform on you to the, the yeah, defense. You know those spies. Just a bunch of little, bunch of bunch bitchy, bitchy little, little girls. girls. Family too, if you're desperate. Oh, what does she say? Michael, so, th- someone, someone needs your help. Because yeah. <laughs> when you're burned, you're not yeah, going, going anywhere. anywhere. Good job. Good job. That was good. That was good. I felt right. Yes. It felt Thank right. You. Thank you. Think about it. Good evening. Uh, I'm Michael Weston. <laughs> I used to be a spy. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Damn you. Stop it. 
All right, we're going to take a quick commercial break yes. for some sponsors. You know who you are. We do too. Yes. But no one else does either yet. So we'll be back shortly. Hey, welcome back, gang. Hope you enjoyed that lovely sponsor message or whatever. I just hung something on the wall. Yeah. Nick has a new piece of art. Another it's, new uh, piece of art. I'll post it. I'll post Gandalf the leather clad. Yes. It's a uh, new DC Legends character. Wow, look at. I thought, I, for a minute there, I thought that was of uh, that Katie Lotz. It's like, wow, she has a beard now. What is going on here? Uh, those are pants. Are you sure? They're pants. <laughs> Are you sure they're I pants? promise they're pants. Here, hang on. Let me fix that for I'm you. I'm posting this photo. No, damn you. Just you son of a pants. bitch. Just fix the pants. Artists can't take criticism, man. I'm taking I can, criticism. I can take criticism, and I'm an artist. Formerly known as Prince. No. Uh, Whoa, that was Michael shit. Jackson. Uh, All right. Well, now there's pants. Uh, see, Nick? Oh, come on, dude. They're pants now. He colored it in. The pants now. He colored it in. It looked like he had, there was like a dick or something. Like you know, he's like... in white clad leather. <laughs> Gandalf's not wearing anything under the. I don't feel like wearing pants today. Speaking of that, vicious on BBC. Excellent Great show. show. Great show. Loving that show. That's an awesome show. I'm surprised they haven't anything in Comic Con. Let's put it down here, man. With the rest of the artwork. Being put away and burned by the... By the way, if you guys have any artwork that you want to send in to us, we will gladly display it. Somewhere. Somewhere. Maybe up here. It varies. We'll, f we'll feature it each episode, maybe. Yes. So if you have some fan art, send it in. You know, we'll if it's good. We'll see more of Stu's yeah. room of yeah. requirements. Yes. We require you. We require yes. more art. Fine art. So scene, scene. What the fuck? <laughs> we need more art. More fine. I need more art scene. and end scene. <laughs> God damn it! So uh, let's talk about Arrow. Arrow just cast Neil McDonough oh, as Damien, Damien Dark. Dark. You know, yeah. previously, I just want to highlight some of the big things of his career. <laughs> uh, previously. Wow, you almost spit on your computer. I almost did. <laughs> I almost did. Previously in his Son career, he was in Star Trek First Contact as Lieutenant Hawk. You know, the crew member that got turned into a Borg on the uh, uh, dish Damn. and then attacked, I think, Worf, actually, who then killed him. Uh, mind you, killed Hawk. Sorry. And also Marble. as uh, Whit Bass from Angels in the Outfield. I couldn't believe that when you when that's you correct. That little fact. Uh, little that fact is correct. There. Hey, the man did the work. He yeah. did well. Yeah. I think he's an excellent choice actually for Damien Dark. He was in uh, he was in Justified. He was I know he was a uh, Angels in the Outfield. Yeah, Star Trek. Great First actor. I, I think he's gonna do awesome. Epic actor. Can you, I can just see him going toe to toe with uh, with Stephen Oliver. Amell. Yeah, Stephen Amell. Uh, it's kind of I, I I don't know if they're gonna tie him in being like the leader of, of Hive like you know you have Amanda Waller with you know oh, Suicide yeah. Squad and Argus I think we're gonna I think we're gonna see a little bit of the Hive uh, in season four and you know it's gonna be interesting to see what they're gonna do with that character so uh, he's definitely gonna be a huge factor uh, so I uh, I'm really excited yeah me too. I just I don't know how they're gonna get Oliver back uh, back into Starling or Money. Star City. <laughs> Money here. We want you to come back. Hey, Money. Call yourself Green Arrow. There's some money. Or Wink. We, or Felicity gets killed or something, which is what don't a lot. Don't you? Of, which is what a lot of fans speculate. Don't you dare say that, sir. Hey, take it up with Team Felicity, motherfucker. I'm on no teams. I'm, I'm just all about the show being the best it can be, goddammit. I can't believe you just said Team Felicity, motherfucker. Good God. <laughs> I was hoping that was going to explode. Good God. Fun. Dude, I love Felicity. Team Felicity, goddamn. No, I love Felicity, I love Felicity too. Felicity. I love Felicity, the too. Only, only thing that's bad about Felicity, not my girlfriend. Like so many starlets right now, but still. And uh, Allison Skagnat Skagnetti. 
Scaliati. Scaliati. Oh. Scaliati. I messed up his future Jeez, wife's silence. name. Sorry. Oh, fuck, I can't. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's going to happen, people. Circle this moment is the one that you realized bullshit call. <laughs> oh, you never know. You never know. She could be watching this she video. She could also be she watching. She could be watching this video and be like, And oh she'd be like, God. ooh, ooh. Who's that okay. Santa Claus looking oh. motherfucker right there? <laughs> ooh. Ooh, his face. Ooh. Ooh, the, it's a bowl ooh. full of jelly. Ooh. Let me feel his lack of tautness. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. You never know. Oh, yes. Let's see. Stranger we have, things that happen. We have... We have well, yes. Like, uh, <laughs> I can't think of anything right now. Uh, There's a few faiths that are based Stranger on things have happened. Stranger things have happened, like Batman and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, joining up. That I don't like. They're, they're going to be doing a comic book series. I don't series care for it. About Batman. Is it and a comic book series or are they doing a movie? It's a comic. Oh, then I don't give a fuck at all. Yeah. That's fine. I couldn't give less of a shit now. No, if they were doing a movie, that that's kind of messed up. Mm -hmm. That's just taking it in a wrong direction. A very campy direction. No, I mean, the comic is called it's Batman Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Versus Batman. And it's going to be published by two companies. And Shredder gets transported to an alternate universe by General Krang. Uh, they meet Batman and Clash. And <laughs> I don't even know how this is gonna, how this is even possible. I mean, the like my the, the inner child inside me is like yeah, because I love Batman and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. On the other hand, yes, the child that is inside of him, yes, is like yeah, is like yay. But then adult me is, like, and then all you hear is this light echo out of his anus. <laughs> yeah, so I, uh, you know. A swift punch to his own stomach. Shut up in there. <laughs> oh. Well, as we were talking, it's all about the money, baby. It's all about the money. It's all about so. that bean, about that green. Uh, maybe I'll have to get a, I'll have to get a uh, comic and see what it's all about. But. I'm gonna go with Sherlock. Mm. Which you forgot about. <laughs> now, what did what did you think about that trailer, man? I mean, obviously it was awesome. Uh, we can huge fan. Yes. Uh, I mean, it's, it's fucking Sherlock. It's going to be awesome. Yeah. They don't even need to fucking put out a trailer. They can, just, they can literally just have Benedict Cumberbatch or Martin Freeman walk out and be like, hey, uh, there's going to be an episode on Tuesday next week. Mm -hmm. We'll see all of you then. They could have just read that title that, that just says Sherlock, coming soon-ish. Yeah. And that would have been, like, huge. Yeah. That alone. That it. Done. Yeah. But, <laughs> I... I got nothing more to say. It, it, yeah. it was a good trailer. It had me there the whole time. Uh, it's old school. And, that, uh, fuck it. That's, that's what I'm excited about, is yes, that we sir. actually have old school Sherlock. I heard, I heard you, read, I heard you uh, published a new book. I did. I did. Obviously referencing the Twitter account that he has. <laughs> uh, or not Twitter account, but his blog. Did you like it? No. no. <laughs> oh, come on. I wasn't oh. even in that, the dog one. I mean the hounds of Baskerville, really? <laughs> all you do, is, all you do is think I walk a people, walk clients up the stairs, show people you know, yeah. popping and bring you food. Uh, that yeah, that was awesome. I, what did he say about the smash? He had, smash? he either I, he said that uh, he either the illustrator, it, he either grew it to be recognized or yeah. grew it to be not recognized. I couldn't remember which. He he grew it to be recognized. To be recognized. And it's funny because in the new season, he remember when he had that. Yep. He had that weird muscle. Oh, I know. It looked kind of strange. The one he had in the trailer, I was look good. Was awesome. Look good. It looked good. Look good. But the one, the one he had last season. Not to steal from a uh, big looked, red commercial. Look yeah. good on you. Yeah. The last one he had was like a poop smear. It did not. Look it did good. look it like did not shit. Look good. It looked like shit. It looked across like, the face. Yes. It was uh, kind of weird. A little bit. Yeah. A little bit. Not a Nick. Not a Nick. Not a no. Nick. Uh, Nick. Mustache. No, Nick mustache. Nick can grow. Is, Nick can grow a pretty good mustache. I grow a be. I'm grow a fucking mean stash. You guys want Nick to grow a mustache? Holla! Make sure you like the video. Like, subscribe, yes. and donate money. Because he will grow a mustache. I will. I usually cut it to be because I'm bored. But you want it? Well, this sounds bad, but pay me. There you go. Or become an advertiser. That also works. Go. We're happy with that. Yeah. Because the less we're we looking to pay for sponsors, for, the better. Always looking for new sponsors, local and nationwide. Looking for a good reason not to have to use an Indiegogo campaign 
or Kickstarter, just cause. Let's see. You've got one more, buddy, for the third half of the show. It could cut us right the fuck out. Let's do it. Here we go. Fear the Walking Dead. Trip. Fear of the Walking Dead. Ooh. Fear the Walking Dead. Mr. Oh Vickle showed us this one. Yes, thank you, Nick. Oh yes, thank you for pointing that out for us. The man. Vickle. Ooh. The Vickle. The Vic. Ooh, dude, what did you think? What are, what's your reaction? I more or less lately have just not really given a shit about Walking Dead. Uh, it's not that I don't find it interesting. It's I can't watch it like everyone else does. Do you feel like it moves too sweet? Do you feel like it moves? I mean, way that's, the, that's, the the huge, that's the hugest problem of the goes series. Goes way too slow. So slow. But I'm looking forward to the, the up and coming season because um, I can't remember his name, but the uh, the black guy from the first episode. What was his fucking name? Oh, um, he's back. Yeah, yeah. And it looks fucking phenomenal. Their trailer was awesome too. But we're talking about the Fear of the Walking Dead. And that trailer was beautiful. That trailer had everything I really wanted yeah. in it. You, you, it. It was surprise. It was scary. It was dramatic. It was interesting. It was deep. Yeah. And it... it oh, God. It just looks so goddamn good. I want to see it. And the thing is, we never had that in Walking Dead. We never had the, well, here's how it all started thing happen. Yeah. This is... Okay, we're going from how we are right the fuck now to... Holy shit, we're all going to die pretty goddamn quickly. I think that's interesting. They, they don't know whether it starts off as like a some sort of virus or some sort of microbe, microbe or something like something weird like that. And I, I just think it's kind of interesting that there, you know, there's still some normalcy, but then you gradually see things go to shit. Like goddamn right. Like that that was awesome to me. I I, I, I love seeing the breakdown. Bunch of people chaos. sick today. Yeah. Thought you'd be one of the next victims. Yeah. Uh-oh. Mm -mm. Well, in this we de in this series, I can tell you're definitely going to have like a family. Yeah. It's going to be about a family, which will and, be awesome. Oh yeah, I like that too. It will be fucking great. I love that too. There will be no Carls in this fucking uh, spot. Coral. No Coral. Fucking Coral. Coral. God damn it, Coral. Coral. This looks like it'll be pretty damn good. Coral. I mean, no Coral bullshit. Um, and it, it, now, was is this going to tie? Uh, isn't this going to eventually? Tie in with it sounds like it's going to actually tie like they're going to run into each other. Yes. Maybe their groups or something. Because if I remember correctly, this is taking place every season break is a year that passes. Oh, if I remember correctly, so time will be fucking jumping through. Yeah, oh, man, me. <laughs> <laughs> Give or take. <laughs> Give or take, basically. Give or take. That's what I'm saying. Basically, uh, yes. Yeah, it looks pretty damn awesome. I, I love that, you know, it show, shows things just slowly start going to shit. Like rioting, yes. power kind of flickering going out. They're just hiding in some random grocer's yeah. house. Just And you're seeing glimpses of some of the, the dead zombies themselves. Shit that's just coming. The walkers. Walkers. It's a walker. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty pumped for this, man. It's I'm super huge. duper excited about this. It's gonna be huge. I'm um, not gonna lie. I'm AMC does a great job with a lot of things. I've just started to wane in my interest. Uh, we're gonna have a, a Vickle actually on coming up shortly uh, to give us a little Walking Dead run through. Mm -hmm. He knows both the comic and the show, and we're gonna go through it all. And who better to have than Vickle? Yeah. There's so much more Comic Con stuff that I'm sure we probably haven't touched on, but uh, we'll we'll definitely post some stuff on our website, uh, and, and you guys can check out some articles. We we left out, we're probably leaving out some stuff here. I know ben, um, there was a story about Ben Affleck that you know he's going to be directing his own yeah. thing, writing his own thing. He's basically which, Batman, which is fucking awesome. It, it's going to happen. I can see it happening. Oh god, yeah. Because he's going to have he's going to have uh, Geoff Johns on board, and he's the creative. He's the creative guy behind yes. DC. That's, Marvel did the same thing with uh, Kevin Feige. It's Who's honestly it's Kevin? honestly a smart move to do that. This guy knows this guy knows the continuity in the universe inside and out, and he's going to help you bring that continuity to the movie the, the movie Fuck universe. Yes. So I'm, I'm I'm pretty happy that if that does happen. So that just recently came out the other day, yeah. and hope so hopefully on Saturday. They reveal this uh, info. Right now we're filming on 
Friday. Is so. it? Yeah, it's, it's, it's Friday. Friday. Friday, everyone. Well, this, this will probably come out. This will probably roll out on Monday. This will probably roll so. out a week from yeah. Monday. Or two. Good evening. Or three, no. You guys can check out all the the stories and stuff from Comic-Con and uh, all, all the most recent things that we posted on our website at geekecpodcast.wordpress.com. Mm-hmm. Send us an email at geekecpodcast.gmail. Geek EC podcast. <laughs> take, take two. Take two. We're not cutting it. I'm just fucking Jesus. stopping for a second. No, take two. Take three. You can get take us four. <laughs> Email us. Take four. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I'm just going to say it one more time. Slap if you want, but I ain't stopping. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, you can get us on email. You can hit us on either. Fuck <laughs> me. Jesus you can Christ. hit us on. He's falling apart, man. <laughs> you can hit us up on our Gmail, geekecpodcast at gmail.com. Yeah, that's what the is one. it? Geekecpodcast at gmail.com. There it is. Hey, there it is. He got it. He yes, got you it. can email us there. Uh, oh, gosh. Uh, yeah, also, makes, yeah, YouTube oh. at youtube.com slash the geek eclectic. Make sure to like and subscribe. Oh, yes. couple videos. What do we have coming out uh, shortly? Um, I, know, I think we are finishing up the Grow Home series. Yeah, you're going to be finishing that up. That's me. How you doing? Yeah, Grow Home is almost done. Um, let's see. What's next? <laughs> oh, our video of Call of Duty, of Call of Duty Zombies. Black Ops. Oh, yes. Zombies. Throwback. I think we're going to make it like a throwback series. Yes. Where we play indeed. just old games. Yes, indeed. Yeah. I'm telling you. Uh, we're putting a little option out there for you guys. Uh, if you want us to actually make them smaller episodes, yeah. you're perfectly able to, and we've actually made plans for it. But if you want the full extended thing, because I've, I've watched yeah. it myself, I think it's way the fuck better as the full version. Yeah. Let us know if you want like an hour, do you guys want 20 minutes? We like can do highlights for all I give a shit. Yeah, we don't care. We'll just whatever let us know. you want. We'll do whatever the hell. We're we cheap whores right yeah. now. We're cheap whores. Whores. Uh, whores. So, yeah. <laughs> You guys uh, can hit us up. Uh, also, hit us up on Twitter at the Geek Eclectic. Make sure to like and subscribe this video. Sure. And uh, we'll see you next time. You do it like a cat. This has been Geek Eclectic. Thank you. And good night. Like sleeve of wizard. And there's his his dick is hanging out.